Hello everyone, my name is Marcelo and this video will learn how to write data on Excel files. So first we will learn how to write uh, basically data from data tables variables into Excel files. So let's first create a data table with some data. So let's click on activities and let's uh, search for the action uh, will data table or better the activity will data table. And let's drag this activity to our automation. And so let's build the data table, a simple one. So first column can be the column name. And then this column can be country of type string. So now let's input here some data. So we have already here some data for our data table. So let's click here on OK. And now let's create a variable that will be of type data table and we'll get the data that we created here. So let's create the variable pt underscore Excel, for example. And now how we can so write the data that it's here on this data table on uh, our Excel file. So we have some ways to do that. So let's go to the more simple one. So let's search here for the activity right range. And we can see here that we have two right range activities. Let's use the one from workbook. So let's drag this activity after the build data table activity. And so uh, what this activity will do we will create Excel file and so with the data from our data table. So first we have to indicate the workbook path. So of the Excel file of, on this case that will be created. So let's open the old quotes and let's type in data.xlxx. And so by the key theme here, just the name will be created the Excel file on our project. Now here it's the sheet name, so we can leave like this. Here it's the starting cell where it will be wrote the data from the data table, can be this one. And now we have to indicate here the data table that will write the data on the Excel file. So in this case, it's the data table. So let's here call it. And now also here we can see on the properties of our activity, that we have here the option add headers. And by this way, we indicate basically that the first row written should be the column names from the data table as it says here. So as you can see, we have here the column names. So let's here uh, check this option. And now let's run our automation to see the output. So let's run. And so now let's refresh here our project and we can see that was created the excel file data so let's open it and as we can see here the data from our data table was exported to this excel file so now let's learn how we can write data on this excel file in a specific uh, cell so let's say that we want now to write here on uh, basically uh, two cells can be here the D1 and E1, so on these two cells. So how we can do this? So uh, let's here on activities search for the activity right cell. And so let's use the one from workbook. And so now we just have to indicate the workbook path. So uh, in this case, it's this one. And now at this time, we have to provide here the value that we want to write on the cell. So in this case, can be test, for example. And now here we have to provide uh, the cell. So when, where we want to write the value. So in this case, it's the cell D1. So let's type in here D. And now let's use another right cell to write here on the E1, so here. So let's change here. 
so the Excel file it's the same and now he or she name it's this one and now uh, cell content can be second test so uh, let's close our Excel file and let's execute our automation So, already finished its execution, so let's click here on project and let's open our Excel file. And as you can see, so our Excel file contains the data from the data table and now also contains the data that was brought by these two activities that so wrote on this cell on, on this one. So in this video, we have learned how we can write data on Excel file with the data from a data table and also how we can write on a specific cell. So I hope you liked this video and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more RPA related videos. Bye bye.